what's up guys? Today we're credit whoring around New Jersey boardwalk parks because <laughs> there's like a few parks we're going to today. We had an extra day. Oh, there it goes. Um, Hydra's is running. Okay, cool. Um, so the reason we are at this first park, which is Casino Pier, is because they have Hydrus, which is a Gerslauer Eurofighter coaster. It's actually an exact replica of Adrenaline Peak at Oaks Park in Portland, Oregon, which I rode in 2018. So two years later, and I'm coming back to ride its sister coaster in New Jersey. And I'm looking forward to it. It looks fun. It has lap bars, so it should be good. And yeah, let's go have some fun at Casino Pier. It's gonna be fun. We just got off of Hydrus, it was a walk-on, and we got a Zen ride! That was All of our first times. All of our first times. Uh, of course, I've been on a clone of it, and it's just as good as I remember. It's really solid. It's, it's very smooth. Uh, a lot of good forces. The inversions are just so much fun. The color scheme is great. The view from the top is excellent, which is what you don't get on Adrenaline Peak. That was a very fun ride. You like it? Yes, that was honestly a lot better than I expected. It was very forceful, like I found myself yeah. just like yeah, it is. pushed down at a lot of points. I was it fun, Sammy? It was fun. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We're about to head to Pirates Hideaway, which has a reputation for being one of the worst like coasters of all time. I'm not so sure what to expect. It looks very, very weird. So we're gonna he head to that and then we're gonna do Hot Tamales, the kitty coaster. And then we'll be on our way to the next park. Let's do this. Okay, we did Pirates Hideaway. Honestly, this is why I don't listen to like most enthusiasts' opinion before I ride something myself because that was one of the smoothest coasters I think I've ever been on in my entire life. It was a bit janky at times, but the drops literally felt glass smooth. Honestly, that was not that bad. What'd you think, Pirates um, Hideaway? It wasn't as bad as people say it is. I mean, it's a little bit janky. Some of the transitions, like, but like, honestly, it wasn't that bad. It really wasn't. Sammy, was it, was it fun? Not that bad, 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 bad. Zero screams. <laughs> okay. All right. Next, we're going to Hot Tamales, the kitty coaster, which has an absolutely ridiculous front car. So let's do this. Okay, well, Hot Tamales was just annoying. We had to ride it five times, pretty much. But it was kind of smooth. So. It was kind of smooth. The smoothest kitty coaster I've been on. Like, most of them... The, Why are all the coasters like, here glossy smooth? Yeah, what? <laughs> the most kitty coasters feel like a newborn baby designed them. Like, it works. Like, yeah, yeah, it does. Um, all just, like, all the coasters here besides Hydrus are just, like, smooth but janky. 
Yeah, and Hydra's is just flat out smooth. It's really good. Uh, but yeah, so that's all for that boardwalk park. It was a nice, charming little place. Uh, so now we're heading on to the next one. Yes, we are. One hour later. Okay, we made it to stop number two after an hour drive. It actually didn't feel bad it did at not all. Feel like yeah. a long drive. Uh, so we're at Jillian's Wonderland Pier. I might be butchering the pronunciation, but I think I'm right. It might be Gillian's. Um, we're here because it's literally right next to Playland's Castaway Cove, which is the reason we're in Ocean City, New Jersey, because Gale Force looks amazing. But uh, there's a wacky room to get here, and there's also a Larson drop tower. That's what we spotted on the way in, so I think we might just have to get, get a ride on that. I mean, Larson drop towers are insane. You guys know I love those. Like, from the Knobles vlog and Waldemir vlog, I wouldn't stop talking about them, so... Let's go get some creds. You can talk. You're fine, you can talk. saw when we were coming in here that there was a Larson drop tower and how could we resist? We have to do it. Sam, it's gonna be fun! Ah! Yes. Whoa! That was insane! That was beyond fun! That was the best thing I've ever done! <laughs> that was insane! Oh my god, the Larson towers. You need to do them if you see them at a park. What do you think about that? That was insane. I was literally it literally hurt my thighs it just like yeah and, it and it's so high it's tall too god damn yo okay we are at playland's castaway cove and we saw gale force running a few times and i'm not okay at all insane. literally the transitioning looks messed up oh my god look at that that's insane kid. are you guys excited no no, no, <laughs> no I'm so excited. The Wacky Worm was the most anticipated credit of the day, so we don't really care about Gale Force. Yeah, anymore. like honestly, I don't even need to ride it. Yeah, it's like, it's it looks good, but... Okay, actually though, we're like fucking excited. I know, I like... We're so I, excited. I, uh, <laughs> We just got off of Gale Force in the very front. Oh my, oh god. my god. It just like threw me everywhere. Okay, you're getting ejector on both of those first two drops. The launches were so powerful, like in the very front. The, the wind was incredible. The transitions were just messed up. It had the perfect amount of like like shakiness to make it like intense, but it also wasn't rough or anything. It was relatively smooth. It was amazing. Okay, the um you get literally a floater off the inversions. I've never experienced something like that before. And I, it makes sense because that's the only one of its kind in the world. That was insane. That's somewhere in my top 20. Yeah, me too. That was insane. Sam, was it fun? It was ultra fun. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, we're going to head on wild waves now. Another credit. Let's go. Okay, we got off of, uh, what is this called again? 
Wild Way is very unique. There's nothing like it in the U.S. very much. Do you like it? It was actually kind of fun. Yeah, I got a lot of air time, surprisingly. So. I was in the back. They were in the very front. And in the back, I was literally getting pulled over a few of those hills. And the interaction with Gale Force is great. So, yeah, it was. I'd say it's a pretty fun family coaster for this park. So next, we're going to head on the SBF Spinner, which is actually going to be my first one of these that I'll have ever done, which is kind of weird. I mean, you'd think out of more than 175 credits that I'd have been on an SBF Spinner, but nope, this is my first, so here we go. All right, so we got off the SBF Spinner, and it was okay. I guess, I suppose it wasn't as bad as I thought, but then again, my expectations were at literally nothing. Like, I did not know what to expect, and I pretty much caught that, like... It was fine. It didn't do anything for me. What did you think? Um, it was like a little bit rough, but little, it was yeah. fun. It was a little, tiny bit like forceful in the beginning. Yeah, a little then bit. Then not really after that, but it was okay. Yeah, now we're trying to find a kitty coaster that should be around here somewhere. Sammy, did you like the SPF? It was fun. It was fun. Mm, okay. Okay, we did their ENF Junior coaster. I think it's called Pirates Gold Rush, uh, and it was actually a really good kiddie coaster. There was one moment of floater, like a, a traditional like floater hill on a kids coaster, and then there's one that was like a sideways floater moment. It was actually fun. Yeah, like um, it? it was a solid kiddie coaster. It was. Sammy, was it fun? It was fun. It was fun. You heard it here first. Okay. Um, now we're gonna honestly just like chip in more money to get another ride on Gale Force because that first ride was so amazing. We can't, we literally just can't walk away without doing another. That was incredible. Okay, here we go, go for it. God, we just got off of Gale Force again in the front. Oh my God. I got a literal crap ton of room and I kept it up the entire time. So much ejector. On the drop, I'm, you're getting sustained ejector. I don't know how you kept it up, but the forces just pushed it down. Uh, you literally just used my legs. I don't know either, to be honest, but that was amazing. Um, and I think that's gonna conclude our crazy New Jersey credit whoring adventure. It was a lot of fun. Did you have fun today? Was this like the best day no. ever? No. No, you didn't have fun? None. But Sam, did you have fun? I had so much fun! Basically, Skylar is just like, stupid. Yeah. I'm not. No, I had a lot of fun. It was fun. Okay, good. All right. Hope you guys enjoy this vlog. This has got to be one of my favorites I've ever recorded. Seriously, today's been amazing. Uh, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.